Hey everyone, Wags here from Field Dynamics, and in this DCS FA18C Hornet video, we'll take a look at some of the changes coming to the Tronic Warfare or EW page. This consists of new ALR67 symbols and enhancements. It's important to understand that these enhancements are regarding existing emitter contacts on the EW display. They cannot be displayed independent of an emitter symbol. Let's get started. Now first we have a new symbol for early warning radars or EWRs and these are low frequency radars uh, that operate independently of SAM sites. These appear on the EW page as the stylized radar dishes now. Now another new symbol coming is radar guided anti-aircraft artillery and examples include the uh, ZSU-23-4 Shilka and the Gepard. And that symbol on the EW page appears as A with a bent line above it and two protruding lines above that. Okay, now let's take a look at some of the enhancements to the EW symbols. First, we see an open X around these two emitters up ahead, and that simply means that both of these uh, contacts are actively jamming with their ECM electronic countermeasure systems. Now, in this case, we're tracking a target with a FLIR, and it's correlated with an EW contact. When that happens, we have that correlation between the FLIR and the EW contact. You can see a circle around the EW emitter. Now here we see the harm tracking an SA6 and it's correlated with the EW symbol up on the EW page and you can see that indicated by the staple below the symbol. So the last element we'll talk about are new indications on the EW page for correlated friendly and ambiguous contacts. So in this case, we can see we have an 18 ahead of us with a hemisphere on top that indicate that it is a friendly correlated target. Whereas to the left, we see a 29 with a staple and that staple indicates that it's an ambiguous correlated contact. As before, if it has a triangular hat above it, it means that it's correlated as hostile. So folks, hope you enjoyed this little video and I will see you next time. Thanks.